Welcome back to um, another Landon and Alex podcast where we talk about our favorite top three um, items, whether that be in movies, video games, or music. Today we're going to be talking about the top three Call of Duty games because recently, actually yesterday, Call of Duty um, Modern Warfare 2019 officially came out and has swept the world and everyone is now saying it is the greatest Call of Duty ever made. So now we're going to talk about our favorite Call of Duties. My top three favorite Call of Duties, they would have to be number one, Black Ops 2, number two, Black Ops 3, and number three, Modern Warfare 2. Now, I will start off with Black Ops 2 because that game was one of the first games that I played that was like a shooter and like one of the first Call of Duties that I played. I remember playing it with all my childhood friends. Like, we would play right after school until right before we, we had to go to bed. It was just our go-to of what we did. And I just made so many memories and friends off of Black Ops 2 that it was just an amazing experience. I would say Black Ops 3 is next because it wasn't really for the multiplayer this time. My favorite thing about Black Ops 3 was the zombies. That was my go-to. I used to play with my friends. We would just, like, have a really fun time, play for, like, three hours, and just, it was an amazing experience. And my number three, Modern Warfare 2, that was such a new type of multiplayer. It was the first multiplayer Call of Duty that was, like, actually really good, I would say. And it just made... It made Call of Duty the way it is today, with its multiplayer and team deathmatch, just, it made it Call of Duty. Alright, so, I actually have four, but, um, one of them isn't in the top three, it's actually a runner-up. It's, um, it would be my top three, but the only reason I'm not going to say it is, is just because the, uh, the weaponry, I mean, I didn't really enjoy it that much, I mean, I like more futuristic stuff, more modern day stuff. But um, World at War, I mean, it was revolutionary. It's the first Call of Duty I've ever played. Um, it's when Zombies came out. It's the first game with zombies in it. And the campaign was amazing. Just like the storm. Storm Stalingrad or Try to Survive the Beaches in um, Japan was awesome. Um, my, uh, my third choice, though, is um, got to be Black Ops 2. Just because everyone loves Black Ops. And it was futuristic but not trying to be over futuristic with like you're flying all across the map and all that jazz I mean it had a really great campaign it continued the Black Ops 2 campaign or the Black Ops 1 campaign it was awesome my number two is Advanced Warfare it was kind of the breakthrough of the the jumping across maps with exosuits and stuff thought the campaign was amazing um, got a lot of got a lot of harsh feedback as it they kept trying to change it throughout the years with new updates where you could be like a clown like that was way too much they let it live way too long but for the time it had I thought it did really well I thought a lot of people enjoy it I know I did because I, I played that so many times like I stayed in all Christmas break just to play that game and my number one is Call of Duty 4 Modern Warfare the first one on the Modern Warfare series that was um, a really good game really great game campaign was awesome the one where you go into that secret russian city that was destroyed by a nuke and you're a sniper in a ghillie suit like that's just the coolest thing ever um that was the first call of duty i played with my friends online and um it was awesome i remember one match like i literally found a hacker and he, he boosted me up to like master prestige um so that was cool so that made the game way more enjoyable because i had everything unlocked for me but I didn't get banned because I'm not the one that was happy. But still, that's that was my top top four favorite Call of Duties. And I don't know, my opinion might change based on the new Call of Duty that just came out. I haven't got to yet to play it yet, but I saw a lot of stuff on it. It's basically redoing the whole story of Modern Warfare, and it's supposedly rated the best Call of Duty ever made, just gameplay and overall story-wise. What do you think about it? I mean... I didn't play a whole lot of it. I mean, it was very fun. I played the campaign. That's the one thing I do in all of the uh, Call of Duty games. Like, every time somebody gets 
a Call of Duty, the first thing they do is jump on multiplayer, which is not my, that's not my go-to. My go-to is just story. So I just did the campaign, and I think it was a really good campaign. Yeah. There's only been a few Call of Duties with a bad campaign. Call of Duty Black Ops 4 didn't even have a campaign. Like, yeah. Why, how are you going to make a Call of Duty without a story? Call of Duty is known for their gritty, like, stories about terrorism and all that stuff. Like, stuff I think the World War II campaign. Oh, my God. Call that one. That one was a good campaign. That was great. Supposedly, the, the new campaign on this one is, like, the, the grittiest one they've ever told. I'm not so sure about that. We'll have to see. We'll have to see. Tune in next time where we go over our next top ten items. I'm Landon. And I'm Alex. See you next time.